Hi, I'm T. Cooper and I'm a New York based makeup artist and hairstylist. Today I'm going to show you how to do a fun rockabilly hairstyle. For this style, all you'll need is a one inch curling iron, one of my favorites, some hairspray, some bobby pins, and if the spirit moves you, a fun accessory, kind of like this flower. So we're going to get started. So I'm going to take my comb and a lot of these rockabilly styles, they have like a deep part on the side. So I'm going to do a super deep part on the side of my model, section that on over, push the hair back. I'm going to make three sections. I'm going to do two sections on this side, one section on this side. And I'm going to section out what's in front of her ears. And for this, I'm going to clip it back just so that I can be nice and neat with my work. So I'm gonna start off by doing kind of a faux victory roll here. So I'm gonna section out just a little bit in the front. This is gonna be her faux bang, and this is what we're gonna use to make a roll. So making a roll takes some practice. Sometimes I don't even get it right. So don't get frustrated with it. You can take two fingers like so, roll up the hair, and then continue to roll as you go. As tight as you want or as loose as you want. This is all about your personal style. Then you take a bobby pin, you pin the hair in place like so, and you fix your roll as you like. And I'm gonna take another pin and I'm gonna pin it down here so we won't have anything sticking out. Very cute. You can also take your comb and just kind of smooth it out. And this roll is done. Now, this is gonna be our faux bang to speak. So we're gonna take this, I'm gonna take some hairspray, comb it all together, and I'm gonna make a roll going forward. So I'm gonna take two fingers. This is how I like to do it. Some people like to start with the roll on top. I like to start closer to the base, but that's just the way I do it. You can figure out what works best for you. And then you take your pins, and then you pin it into place. Crisscross your pins if necessary. Michelle's hair has a lot of grip to it, so I don't really need to crisscross right here. And then I'm gonna do my final roll on the other side. So I'm gonna repeat the process, spray a little bit, take my comb, do a little roll close to the base, and pin that in place, just like so. Pin on the top as well. Now if you like the look of this, then you're done, but me, I think a cute little fun accessory is in order. So I'm gonna take a flower, I'm going to pin it in her hair like so, just to give her that 40s look, modern day rockabilly. And then you're done. I'm T. Cooper and I just showed you how to do a modern updated rockabilly style.